Hello. Vehicle is a 1997 Nissan D21 pickup. It's got a KA24E motor, four cylinder, five speed. There's some there. All right. MPG mods. Mirrors are turned in. According to the website I read, it is 1.5 MPG for each mirror you turn in. Of course, that it, you know, that uh, matters on the mirror. Did a mud flap delete for MPG. Actually, the mud flaps on the truck were about uh, an inch and a half wider than the tires. <laughs> All right, and then there's vents up here that or for the uh, AC system, you can run vent or you can run AC and have the air coming in from the outside. And air was just, you know, going right in there, making the aerodynamics horrible. So taped up both of them, just with some electrical tape I got at Walmart for like 57 cents. I'm also doing a, down there, doing a, uh, a glass pack on the exhaust. The longer the exhaust is, the more resistance on the airflow that's going through there. So more resistance, longer the pipe. Shorten the pipe and make it more free flowing, like with a glass pack, more MPG. You don't need any more back pressure than the Cadillac converter is already giving you. So the muffler is just for sound, and so if you have a resonator can, same thing. So go ahead and cut those off and shorten it. All right, I got a can and air filter in here. Uh, the intake used to run from all the way over here, all the way over to here, okay? So I shortened it about three feet <laughs> and again uh, air resistance running through the p uh, f through the um, intake is also the same thing kind of like the exhaust so shorter the intake more uh you know less strain on the uh, motor more mpg more hp okay eventually doing an electric fan which is about 15 uh horsepower which depending on your motor the smaller the motor uh 15 horsepower has more of a drastic um, difference on than a bigger motor so about a v8 and i put an electric motor on it i mean i'd get like you know half a mile a gallon you know more on this little thing you know it's about 1.5 you know to, to about two you know depending on you know what exactly i do there uh, i found one on jegs for about uh 70 bucks it's only nine amps too so that's gonna be good i'm also doing a grill block i'm gonna block out one third of the grill and those little light, those little uh, inserts right here on either side, I'm gonna block out as well. Um, let's see, I'm also gonna remove the back bumper for MPG. The uh, the back bumper is actually shaped where it goes down like this, and that just catches a lot of air. And every bumper I've ever seen was always made like that, except for like the roll pan, you know, muffler or bumpers. Um, so I'm gonna, then I'm gonna get a two to two and a half um, diameter pipe tubing. You go from one end to the other, and then I'm getting a uh, height hitch going down there, and then I'm relocate the uh, the license plate. One more thing that people don't ever mention in any website, any form, anywhere, um, is the, of course, the alternator puts strain on the motor, but no one lightens the strain on the motor normally. So every light maybe not the headlights but every other light is going to be led for less strain on the alternator therefore less strain on the motor mpg so all these lights are eventually going to be led you can get them on amazon for about five bucks for a pair which isn't too bad all right um thanks for listening